You know, uh, when Dad, 30 years ago, was the first to go Republican. And uh, we'll first go back Democrat. We got some work to do. We're going to run them all out of there. Let's go back to more Democrats. Like, okay, let's get busy with the Secretary of Election. Yeah, yeah do you have or any other things? Yes. All right, you ready? Good afternoon, Democrats. I've introduced myself before. I'm Bo's mom, Wendy. And uh, I've always been Ruth's biggest supporter and fan, so he wanted me to bring him up here, but now we're going to put him up. So many of you saw these vote Ruth. It's not just because you need the candy today, but they're little baby Ruths. Get it? Vote Ruth. So you can remember why you should vote for Ruth. Uh, Ruth was really mad at me because she thought that was really cutesy, and she's not really a cutesy gal. Uh, but she isn't going to be here today, so I needed something to have a little bit of edge or twist so you would remember. She's not here because she is professionally a strategic planner. She has a client, Cathedral City, uh, in California, out near Palm Springs, and three months ago they hired her to do this gig, and she couldn't redo that to be here at this meeting, which is one of the reasons she wishes our meetings were scheduled further in advance. And she pledges to make sure she takes care of that for you. Clint's going to talk to you about her other pledges. I need to tell you, she's my party chair, she's my campaign manager, she's a dear friend. I know she's a woman who gets things done. And that's what we need. Hopefully, any, any, everybody who is running for secretary will get you good minutes and improve communication. That should be a no-brainer. We all know it's not a no-brainer. We need to get that done. What I think is the reason we should select Ruth isn't just because of those good communication skills, but because of her background as a facilitator and a strategic planner, what she can add and her experience she can add to the executive committee. She's been an elected official. She was from Canada. She chose to become an American. Her patriotism made my heart swell when I was old, been to too many conventions, and she was at her first convention, and she's tearing up at the Pledge of Allegiance, and I'm like, what's that about? She goes, I didn't grow up saying that every day in school. It's special to me. I've only said it a few times. We need those different perspectives on our executive committee. She's from Northwest Georgia. We don't have a lot of rural on that executive committee. We don't have a lot of state outside the state on that executive committee. Ruth will get the job done, her, bring her perspective, bring her leadership to this job. And please add Ruth Demeter as our secretary to the DPG. Quinn. welcome you all, but y'all been welcome a billion times. But I will tell you this, I had no expectation to be doing any of this today. I really did. I expect to come to my Democratic family, shake hands, kid cheeks, and just enjoy you all. Because I'm a little particular about who sits in these seats, who sit here as our leadership. Too many times we have people who run for these offices and have never been part of this party before. Example, four years ago, a lady ran for Congressional District Chair and never been to a county meeting or a state committee meeting. She won. Can we really be that surprised when two years into it she stopped because the work was too hard? She didn't know what the heck she was getting into. We need to start pushing the soldiers on the ground who is out here on a regular basis. That's what I'm about. And that's who I like pushing and being part of. This young lady from um, Canada, Ruth, she's one of them. She's a chair. She's been a campaign manager. She had worked throughout this party and continuously want to do that. We need progressive people who want to move us forward. And that's why I'm seconding the nomination of Ruth Dem Demetra. You're going to see a video in a second. I ask you as a leader within the middle Georgia area and a leader within the state party of the state of Georgia to vote for the Ruth Demetra. Thank you very much. I'm Ruth Demeter, and I'm asking for your vote for Secretary of the DPG. I've recently been re-elected Chair of the Floyd County Democratic Party. And here in Northwest Georgia, I've worked with other county chairs and excited citizens to help get people elected. I bring a lot to the table, and I'd love to be able to help move the DPG forward. I have political experience in two countries, as an elected official, as well as a campaign manager for city, county, and state elections. And in those roles, I've gotten a really good sense of what it is we need to help people get elected. And I'm looking forward to being part of the team that can provide those resources. I have experience serving on many different executives in positions all the way from chairperson to secretary. So I have a very clear understanding of the role of secretary. 
I'm able to get accurate minutes out in timely fashion that clearly articulate who has responsibilities and in what timeline. And I'd love to be able to bring that experience to the group, as well as understanding all the positions on the executive so I can help support people to do their job and we can work together. I have a lifelong passion for collaboration. It's important for me that people understand their role, that they have access to accurate data, and that they feel that they're being heard in part of a team effort, and I know how to do that. I'd love to do that for the DPG. I'm committed to having meetings in different parts of the state so that I can talk to county chairs, elected officials, and citizens about what they want for the Democratic Party of Georgia. I want us to set a calendar a year in advance so people can attend meetings knowing that we're going to have quorum and get things done. I'm asking you to vote for me for Secretary of the DPG. I believe I'm the right candidate at this time for this position. I thank you for all your hard work as Democrats and I'm asking you to let me work hard for you as Secretary of the DPG.